to say this termite queen keeps busy is an understatement. In one day, the queen can churn out 20,000 eggs. Along with productivity comes longevity. Queens of this species can live for 20 years. Compare that to the workers in the colony. Even though they are closely related, they only survive for a few months. This termite is not the only social insect that has a vastly different lifespan depending on its role. When studying lifespan and aging, researchers often focus on model organisms, such as mice, fruit flies, or nematodes. Far fewer studies look at these processes in social insects, whose aging takes twists and turns that rival any C. elegans movements. Take the ant species, Platythyrea punctata. Even though members of this colony have the exact same DNA, the ants that reproduce live for about a year. Regular workers survive to about half that age. Scientists are looking into the mechanisms behind these aging differences. In Indian jumping ants, when a queen dies, workers in the nest duel for the right to lay eggs. A handful of them will switch from worker to gammergate, an egg-laying ant. In a way, they are also fighting for their lives. These gammergates live about five times longer than workers. What could be behind this? Scientists have found many intriguing differences between gammergates and other workers. In one example, gammergates have 40% more of a certain type of glial cell in the brain. Glia are cells that protect and support neurons. Defects in glia function are connected with aging in animals such as fruit flies and mice. In a honeybee colony, even non-breeding members can age differently depending on their roles. Younger workers stay in the hive and act as nurses. They care for the queen and the brood. A few weeks later, they venture into the world to collect food for the hive. These foraging bees age and die within two weeks. Damage to a forager's wings can reveal the telltale signs of aging. Perhaps more bizarre, a foraging bee that's called back into the hive to be a nurse suddenly reverses aging. Compared to foragers, these converted workers have higher levels of vitilogenin, a multi-purpose protein linked with longevity. They also learn faster than foragers of the same age. A DNA pathway in the termite queen helps create its own fountain of youth. Researchers have found that they have relatively low transposon activity. Transposons are pieces of DNA that hop around the genome. Often, they disrupt genes and can cause mutations. From humans to C. elegans, older individuals often have higher levels of transposon activity. The same thing happens for termite workers. While promising, the field needs some time to develop. For example, there are only a handful of gene-edited ant and bee strains, compared to the thousands of available mice and fruit fly strains. As scientists find better ways to monitor and tweak genes in social insects, these colonies of critters may help us understand aging in ways that other animals can't. Lessons remain from this tale of button-sized Benjamin Buttons. <laughs>